Hi everyone, it's Tran Bowie. So we can all take our phones out and take pictures. That's so easy, right? But if you're looking for professional photos, I have just the person for you. Now I want you to see, this is just one of her settings. This is right across from the Roswell Square. But Julia Daniel Photography actually takes your memorable moments and just makes captivating photos. Julia, I just love what you do. Um, and Julia also is saying goodbye to the boring backgrounds and the stale studio, so thank you for that. <laughs> You're so welcome. I thoroughly enjoy finding those unique locations, kind of like right here, and finding all of those unusual backdrops for the photos. <laughs> yeah, and I think what's cool is she finds those unusual backdrops, but it doesn't take away from your subject. No, so I want my clients to be the focal point, but I want to tell their story. And sometimes that's in the most unusual locations that bring it out, but I, I really want your, the client to be the main point and that backdrop just enhance who they are. And I love this. Okay, so people have probably been here before, but you have like this cool orange yes. door that you can see, the and then wood. over there the wood <laughs> and the bricks, um, the blue doors as well. So talk to me, what would you consider is your style? Oh, my style, I, I've been told I have a very storytelling style, storybook style. I, and then definitely more of a natural, colorful, uh, style to my art. I love color. Like that is my favorite thing. You're always going to get tons of color photos. So little pops of color, like the doors. Is and like your hair yeah, and your like nails. nails and all of these things. That <laughs> all the color makes me happy. So that's definitely my style. I love that. Okay. So let's talk about your history. When did you discover this passion and this gift for photography? So I have been taking photos since I was little. In my baby books, when I was about four or five, you'll find my Barbies and my stuffed animals all lined up and posed. They're a little off center, but we're, <laughs> we're still, they were all posed. So I've been taking photos my entire life. My passion for capturing other people's memories really came from my children. When my first uh, firstborn was born, he was immediately rushed into the NICU, and I have one photo of him before he was rushed back, and that is so special to me because that was our first moment as the three of us. And I realized how quickly memories go and how important it is to document it for forever. And so I wanted to ensure that everyone had those memories. Okay, so I know that you take a lot of family photos. You take pretty much just any, anyone yes. who needs photos, <laughs> but you do capture a lot of the family. Is that your main clientele? That's my main clientele for now. I love doing families, kids. I haven't found a kid that doesn't end up smiling and saying I'm his best friend by the end. We may have to work through it the entire time, but we end up being friends at the end. Um, I really love capturing children, and so families are just, they're all so unique, and I love telling everybody's story, um, but I do capture everyone. I do bloggers. I, maternity is some of my favorite because it's the very beginning, and it's a moment to showcase mamas and how beautiful they are in that moment because we don't always feel beautiful while <laughs> yeah and you know and that's the thing a lot of people will put off having their family photos or their photos because they don't feel like they look good right now or they have you know don't know what to wear on the shoot so what are your three top tips before setting up a photo shoot with you first off don't change who you are i want you to come to me exactly who you are I want to capture you as you. So probably my top three would be find a photographer that wants to truly capture you, that doesn't want you to change, that doesn't have any of that. The second tip would be find someone that offers styling guidance so you don't have to worry about that because I know that's a huge stressor. So when you book with me, you're going to get an entire style guide that's going to help you coordinate, not match, um, days of white shirts and blue jeans are gone we don't do that anymore <laughs> and so you're gonna get boards to help you with that and if you're still lost you can send me photos of your outfits and I'll help guide you there and probably the third thing would be someone that treasures your memories just as much as they should be 
And so definitely find someone that wants to tell your story and helps guide you and is there through the entire process. I think I found that person, right? <laughs> <laughs> I think we found her. So Julia Daniel, all her information is up here. Um, if you don't believe me that her photos are amazing, just go check out her pages. You are going to be blown away. Thank you oh, so much, thank Julia. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right. Have a great day, everyone.